Hello guys and welcome to another video. Today I will teach you how to install and set up a user for Android. First you need a 64-bit device, a 32-bit device it will not work on Yuzu. MediaTek, Unisoc and Exynos processors will also not work, only Snapdragon devices will work with Yuzu. And a 6 or 8GB of RAM is needed to run Yuzu properly, otherwise 4GB or lower than that will not work. So search for Yuzu at the Play Store, you will see two versions of it. The first one is the free version, so you can try to install it. Or if you want, you can buy the early access version. This one receives uh, updates faster than the free version. After this, create a folder on the root folder of your device called Switch and download the prod and title keys from the description. After you create your folder called Switch, put your uh, prod keys and your games here. Your games will need to be in a .nsp or .xci, otherwise it will not work. Then you open the Yuzu app and click on get started, grant permission, allow all the time and next, select keys so you will search for your keys on your root folder. I have mine on my switch folder so just do this and switch and prod keys so this will successfully be installed. Next one is the game folder, so click in add games, so search for your game folder, like me is switch, use this folder, hello, and next, and done. You can see my game files are recognized here. We can also go to the settings and advanced settings, graphics, and click on resolution. This will allow us to lower the graphics of our game so it can run properly on our device. Also turn on uh, the asynchronous shaders to give it a better performance while you're gaming. Also on the settings, you can install a GPU driver for better performance, like the turnip drivers for better performance of your games. After you install your driver, you can go to play any other games of the switch you want to play and that's it you install use successfully on your device sorry for my bad english